Hey gang, Matt with Atlas Precision Consulting. In today's video, we're going to talk about lots. Everybody loves lots, right? Um, in this video, we're going to talk specifically about lot adjustment uh, and what that means and how to use it. Now, lot adjustment is not like an inventory adjustment, and, and I'll show you how what that looks like. Uh, there is no adjusting inventory in and out of stock. It's more of just adjusting lot quantities or adjusting lot attributes, um, which I will cover in a different video. Uh, but this is where you could do that and easily for one single item at a location. So in this example, I'm going to pull up a location and I'm going to pull up an item here to look at. Just kind of to show you what this looks like. So what I have here is I have two different lots with the same 200 quantity. Um, now I can come in here and also I should point out that this system has been tracking. So this is a lot bin tab. If you were not using bins at all in your system, you would be on the lot tab and you would not have a bin tab to deal with. Um, now what you can do here is you can say, you know what? I actually only have a hundred in here because we mix picked it, mis picked it, sorry. Uh, and you know, we're just moving those quantities around. The most important thing is this total quantity on hand 400 up here and this new quantity uh, down here needs to be the same. So if I came in here and changed this to 350, you can see I'm down here at 450 and if I hit save, it's gonna tell me, no, you can't do that. The quantity uh, doesn't match. Um, so we're just kind of stuck. Um, the other thing you can do, I'm gonna put this back to 300. You can say, oh, we found a lot. We found lot, you know, 25 out here and we have to pick a bin and we can say there was actually 50 in that one and only um, 250 in another one uh, this is our lot extended info i'm kind of glad this popped up uh, this is where a lot attributes will live and a bunch of other data um, we're not really going to go into that in this video we'll we'll cover that in its own video i'm just going to click ok uh, and I'm changing that to 50, and then I'm going to say there was only 50 in this one. So my 400 is the same, even though I've created or brought in a new lot, uh, or an older lot, actually. I could I could have created a whole brand new lot number if I wanted to. When I hit save, now it's going to take the, those quantities and move them all around. So if I come back in here and pull up bolt 5 again, I'll have three lots with those different quantities. Um, again, once we get into lot attributes... I'll, I'll explain that more, but if you do want to change the lot attributes or other things, you would just right click on one of the lots and you would view that lot uh, info. And, and that's the same screen you saw when we added a new lot here. Um, so again, this was just a real quick video on lot adjustments. Uh, if you have questions on lots, if you have questions on anything, just leave a comment down below. Make sure you like and subscribe, and as always, Atlas will be here for your P21 needs. Thanks, guys.